oh gosh okay blessings guys tonight i'm going to be demonstrating to you a shut up spell i'm sorry i'm a little bit all over the place because like always i gotta be getting things from all over the house like for some reason certain things need like always move around and we all know why that happens those of us that have husbands or whatever but anyways um I started working this spell here. It's a shut up spell to shut someone up. Like literally, I've done this spell before for y'all. But like I tell you, I always customize it. This person's going completely over the deep end when it comes to my client. My client's a long time client that I've had for years. Um, and um, she's getting sick over this. So I'm going to put an end to what is going on with her right now. And I'm going to be using, by using her name here and her date of birth here in this piece of paper here. I'm going to be using this, this fish head here, right here. So I like to use fish heads. You can use a tongue. It's more expensive to use a tongue. So I'm being practical. I'm using this fish head here. And I had it in the freezer. Oh, I kid you not. For about a few months, of course. Um, I had it for a few months and I took it down a few days ago. Thinking I was going to do shut ups, but I don't know why I didn't have any lined up. And then my client contacts me today that she needs this done. And I and there you go. I have that fish head right there. So what I'm going to be using here today is, other than the name, the ingredients I'm going to be using from the shop. I'm going to be using some uh, black hexane salt. And I'm going to be using the crushed powder. But into the fish's mouth, other than that, I'm going to add cayenne pepper, of course, some salt. Um, but I'm also going to be using a very important herb here. It's vetiver. Vetiver is a wonderful herb to use when you want to shut somebody up. And this is what we're doing. This is vetiver here. It kind of looks like straw. Um, cut straw. It's very dry. It looks like also kind of like sawdust as well. I'm afraid to smell it. It has no odor to it. But let's go ahead and get some of that vetiver. And you're going to put it into on the name here. Okay. I'm going to begin... To put that there and I want to shut this bitch up is what I want to do all right I want to get her just to shut up right now then I'm gonna just have a few other things in store for her by putting it in here I'm gonna put this her name right inside the mouth of this fish because it's gonna represent her okay so let's go ahead and stick that in there I'm gonna shove it in there this matchstick okay it's in there let's see where you're at right there I'm going to also, now I'm going to put the crushed powder because now I want to really fuck with her because she's been fucking with my client. My clients become near and dear to my heart. A lot. <coughs> a lot of my clients, I get really close with them. Sometimes I don't hear from them for a few months, but they are like part of my family. Once I start working with them, I learn more about their their background, their their family situations, and they it, it, uh, they get they fall in love or things happen in their life, and I get to hear about all this, so I I get close to my clients, right? I added some of the hexane salt into the mouth because every time that she even tries to open her mouth against my client and against my client's family, I want for her mouth to burn and I want for everything to go wrong for this bitch here. Okay, this is what I want. This is my intention now. The cursed powder already has cayenne pepper in it, but I'm going to add a little bit more. The fish's eyes, too, because this is already a representation of that cunt that's doing this bullshit, all right? So we're not just adding ingredients here. We're putting our intention into it. And I'm going to begin to work this fish head here. Where is my salt? Here is my salt. Every time she speaks anything against my client or her family I want for her mouth to burn and this these herbs and the energy of these herbs and these ingredients are going to help me to achieve what I want from this person here to shut her up completely now the vetiver is a very key ingredient we're going to shove a little bit more of that vetiver in here not vetiver vetivert Hey, little dude. We're actually starting to fire outside. We're going to do some more things out there. So, this is what it looks like now. All right. Now, we're going to close its mouth. And we're going to take our pins. And we're going to shove it as best as we can into the fucking fish's gob. 
Don't poke yourself, guys. So I got three of them here. One went in all the way. You see that there? And then the other one, too. Just don't poke yourself. So I'm really shutting this bitch up. That's what I want to do. Fucking shut the motherfucker up. I swear my cat's going crazy next to me. He's trying to eat the fish. 